Hey guys, Ali here today and welcome to The Sims 4 uh, The Sims VIP Building Channel. There we go. Still getting used to it guys, don't get used to Well today we're going to be building a boy and girls uh, 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 a bedroom with two beds, well four beds actually, bunk beds, but The Sims can't actually use the top beds but it just adds a little extra detail to the house, so now uh, I mean to to the room. So there, I'm just building in the walls, um, uh, fixing up the room shape and everything, and that should be the shape done. Oh no, just adding a little something there for the closet covered. I wanted to put the jungle gym inside the bedroom, but there wasn't enough space, so I didn't. Um, yeah, so uh, so now here I'm. I'm just uh, deleting the roof there so I can see inside. But don't worry, I'll put some lights later. Um, now there I decided for the kids bedroom, boys bedroom, I'm gonna go all blue. Which is gonna look really really awesome and, and I'm putting a moon and some clouds and stuff there. You know the stuff which kids like there and then I'm putting, I used a pool ladder, you know, cause I didn't know what else to use and that that looked really really good. I was really really happy with that. So uh, yeah, um, that was cool. Now I'm just using the sim to test out to see if it worked, uh, if they could use it, and they can. Um, so I wanted to put shelves over here, but then I found out your sim, the sims couldn't use the bed. I tried to move it up. Uh, your sims couldn't use the bed either. You, you'll see me try now. Um, so I just decided to take them off. Yeah, I'm trying to make it a bit higher, but in the end I take them off there and I leave the shelves at the top because the sims can't go up there anyway, so it just looks nice. Uh, yeah. So I tried them to use the bed again and they could, so I stopped there and now I'm just putting books and uh, clutter and stuff up there, you know, just to make it look really, really nice. Putting some some posters, pictures, you know, stuff with, which kids like to put on the wall and stuff and um, yeah uh, um, okay where we are yeah, we, um, we were there now now over there uh, there's where I put in the dresser for the, the kids and stuff um, I, yeah, I put some uh, jackets over there and you'll see me put some shoes Right before, right after I f first put some mirrors here, uh, so they could see. I added another non another mirror to the corner of the room just in case. You know, I thought, wow, that would look so good. Um, yeah, so they're just adding in some more clutter. There's that mirror I was telling you about. Um, now here I'm doing the second bed, uh, adding in a in uh, in another pool ladder so it will look like your sims can go up there but they actually can't so I tested out to see if they could use it and it's good so uh, the trick is if you can see that the sims are walking to the bed then it's clearly they can use it because if they can't they complain far away that they don't walk and then complain I think sims 2 did that I'm pretty sure sims 2 complained uh, got to the object first and then complained um, I think that's how it is. Uh, yeah, so now over there I was putting a teddy bear chemistry set and um, and I put two art uh, uh, thing, painting things like opposite of them and I found this really cool idea to put a TV in between the wall there which they could watch in bed. I don't know if they can, probably can't, but it just looks good. Uh, yeah, 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 they can watch like cartoons and stuff in bed while they're sleeping so yeah they can do that um, he, over here I wanted to move the bed a bit back but it, it couldn't fit so I just left it um, I mean it, it just had problems so yep uh, so now they're just adding in another wall so you can't see the uh, TV when you go outside and yeah um, uh, now here I added a computer for them so they can do their work and play games and stuff with two iPads which, which is kind of fun for them um, and and of course uh, 
Now, what are you doing, Ellie? Oh yeah. Uh, now I was putting in, I was putting in those lights um, uh, for your Sims uh, kids to have fun. Now, not just doing the pictures, putting a whole lot of pictures everywhere, and um, yeah, uh, putting millions and millions of pictures. You can never have enough pictures. I can guarantee you that. Um, yep, and uh, uh, um, just putting some, just putting some more large pictures up there. Some posters on top of the, on top of the door, and there, putting a moon and some animals, some uh, thingies there. And you know, making it all colorful for the kids, which they will like. Putting a few clocks around the room so your kids will never be late for school. Well, hopefully they won't. Um, yeah, and, yeah, and putting some school bags and some random books and all that that kind of cool stuff all around uh, uh, the room. You know, just giving it some more some more detail. Uh, and uh, adding a moon rug in the middle, which I thought, wow, looked really, really good. So now here I'm just uploading it to the gallery, choosing a nice room, which I, can, uh, which I thought looked nice. Uh, uh, Cape Town's kids' boys' bedroom. Yeah, yeah, this going to be in the master bedroom. I mean, in in the uh, Cape Town's modern mansion. Uh, which will be really really cool. So now there I'm just typing in the description uh, about it and now I'm uploading it and now here here I'm just doing something really simple changing the color to make it look like a girl's bedroom because I really didn't feel like making a whole different bedroom. So it's the exact same thing but uh, all, all pink and stuff for girls you know. Um, which is pretty cool. Uh, you know, I decided, well, okay, we're going to make that like that for girls. Um, w w which looks really cool when you're coming to changing the colors and stuff. Uh, I was really happy with all things. Then I decided to change the color of the shelves to light because, you know, girls don't like dark, dark colors. Well, maybe some of them do. I don't know. Let me know in the comment section if you like dark colors. I like dark colors in some places, or most places anyway. Um, yeah, so now changing the color of the rug and uh, there I was done. And that was really, really, really fast and easy. Yeah, see how beautiful you can make something look if it's easy. Um, so Cape Town's girl's bedroom. And now typing in the description as always, and you know all of that kind of stuff, all of that kind of awesome stuff. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. Please give me your feedback down below, and also hit that like button. And also do me one more favor, and promise me this: please take care and have a nice day.